And welcome back on this Thursday afternoon. It's Thursday, which means it's time to hear from Corpus Christi Mayor Paulette Guajardo. And today we're talking about stormwater drainage and the issues that have plagued several areas around town. There may soon be a new fee that residents will pay to help address many of those issues. And Mayor Guajardo, good afternoon and thank you so much for joining us. Well, Mayor, we've heard all about some of the horror stories involving the most recent heavy rains several weeks ago of severe flooding in Cal Allen, wastewater overflow in Flower Bluff, and of course, flooding in the, the Los Colonias neighborhood, just to name a few. Now, with a new administration in place, how does the city plan to address these issues? And is it something on your agenda? Well, hi, thanks for having me, Paulo. It's great to be here. Um, yes, so we are exploring, as you heard this last meeting, within the budget process, um, the stormwater uh, management, basically, uh, the restructuring of the stormwater management. And what that means is, um, as you said, here within the last 30 days, we experienced some very torrential rains. Half of the city basically was somehow flooded in one, one way or another, and, and that, the problems that came from that is what this proposed stormwater program, it's a five-year program, would address. Things such as st street sweeping is one that we don't have and desperately do need. Ditch maintenance. Uh, we have stormwater inspection programs that we don't currently have so that we can try and get ahead of or being proactive of taking care of or maintaining and taking care of our stormwater system. Inlet cleaning and of course vegetation maintenance as well and that's just to name a few. We do not have a real stormwater program and all of much of what people saw in terms of the all of the problems that came forth out of that one week of rain come from not having these these particular things um, for example in in place or having this program so we are looking at doing this now you've heard this this means that uh, the average homeowner residential homeowner here in Corpus Christi uh -huh. would get roughly a six dollar separate line item on their water bill um, simultaneously you would see a decrease in six dollars um, due to the rate structure of what that would bring forth for everyone and this is uh, dealing with some issues that folks have dealt with for years. And, you know, as I was mentioned at the top of this, there's a new administration in town and these are issues that you plan on addressing and uh, taking care of. Absolutely. Absolutely, because we, we have to look at these things. We cannot wait for another storm, another event uh, to happen and for people to say, well, why is this happening? No, this is, as I've said, this is a new chapter for the city of Corpus Christi. Um, I'm, I'm new leadership. Peter is still, I still consider him, he's really not new leadership, but he's been here two years and has really directed the city in the right way. Um, he is recommending this. He uh, has spoken to me, obviously, prior to this coming out publicly about why we need this and how this is a part of moving our city forward to give our citizens um, the best service that we can. And, and I, I, I plan on you know, moving this forward so that we can holistically make that decision as a council um, for the better of our city, because we, we have to take those steps. And that's part of, that is part of what I wanna do as the mayor. Well, Mayor, thank you so much for your time today. I know that uh, that'll make a lot of residents happy to know some of those issues will be addressed. We appreciate your time. We'll see you on the next chat. Absolutely. All right, we're gonna take a quick break. Stay with us. We've got a look at weather when we come right back.